6 kilograms of finely machined steel and aluminum delivered in a wooden box. That's the sharpener that has been sent to me from Russia. And now, roll the intro. Recently, I have been contacted by Vladimir, who's the expert manager at TS Proof. He asked me if I wanted to have a look at their newest model of sharpener, the KO3. Well, you're seeing the video, so I clearly said yes, and oh boy, what a nice machine it is. First, let's get the stones wet. They are water stones and must soak for a couple of minutes before they can be used. My machine came with 120, 220, 400, 600 and 1000 grit stones which I think is the standard configuration. You can buy different stones as well as replacement stones on their website. And I think even Edge Pro Apex stones will fit. This is the knife I'll be sharpening today. It's the K-Bar Heavy Bowie and I have used it to chop wood on countless camping trips. Also, it has never been sharpened before since it was just too big for my old Lansky sharpening system. This machine comes with two sets of clamps. You see me remove the standard clamp, which is good for small and medium sized knives. And on comes the second set of clamps designed to hold even the longest of blades. This works perfect for kitchen knives too. It takes only a couple of seconds to change the clamps. Now you see me put in the knife and tighten the screws. By the way, the hex screwdriver you see here comes with the kit and seems to be CNC milled. Even the handle is branded with the TS Proof logo. I really like that. I have adjusted the turn mechanism to be quite stiff for this big chunk of steel. For smaller knives I'd like it to be a little bit lighter, but this is perfect for now. And then goes the 120 grit zone. You always start with the lowest grit number and work your way up. I'm adjusting the length of travel for the sharpening arm. This prevents injuries and you can't accidentally slip off with your stone and nick your freshly ground edge. This third update of their original sharpener features an all new height adjustment system. By the turn of a knob you can easily set the angle you want to sharpen at. Now, before I start grinding, I like to get the stones really wet again. This helps to form that perfect grinding slurry. Grinding a normal sized knife from start to finish takes about, uh, I'd say 10 minutes. This big one right here took me a little bit longer since it was so dull. Since I got the KO3, I sharpened nearly all of my knives. Overall, I really, really love working with this sharpener. Everything feels so smooth and the whole machine seems to be made to last a lifetime or two. The attention to detail they put in this thing is just amazing. And except for the rubber feet, you won't find a single plastic part on here. This is totally the Mercedes of sharpeners. But just like the new bands I've been dreaming of, it comes with a hefty price tag too. The kit you see here can be bought on their website for 439 US dollars. On the first glance, this might seem like quite a lot for a knife sharpener, but actually, I'm wondering how they are pulling this off. Every single part on this machine is custom made and amazingly finished. The whole thing is built like a tank and will probably outlive me. In conclusion, this machine is not built for the guy who owns 
three knives and wants to keep them sharp. There are definitely more cost-effective systems out there for that. But if you're sharpening knives regularly or you earn money sharpening knives, I'm convinced that this is the best sharpener money can buy right now. After you switch to a new stone, it's always good practice to wipe off that old grinding slurry. It contains particles of the coarser stone, which might ruin the result of the finer stone. Okay, now that the last stone did its job, let's remove the knife and clean it properly with water and soap. After sharpening, I'm always using a leather strap to polish the edge even more. That way you get rid of all the microbursts that form while sharpening. And it also shines up the edge even more. Oh, here you go, the obligatory shaving test. Even though I'm not blessed with a lot of arm hair and you probably can't see a lot, take my word for it, it worked. The guys from TS Proof hooked us up with a good deal on this machine right now. You can find the link to their website in the description. Okay, I think that's all I have to say for now. Thanks for watching, peace bye. Perfect.